Hi, let us look at uh, one of the previous year question that is going to be discussed in your PYQ Kabab series that uh, Dance is going to bring you. For pathology, I am going to present you just like your DVT. We will end up quickly having all view of all the important PYQ. So, let me take this question first, what you are seeing in this. Let us look at this question. Okay, approach, whenever a lengthy question, last line always, I keep saying this. Which of the following is the next investigation? So, you have to identify the investigation. Option given. So, now look, when I look at the option, I look at ferritin is given. Okay, when do I do ferritin? Ferritin is done to diagnose iron deficiency anemia. HbA2, when is HbA2 done? To diagnose or suspect, uh, to diagnose your thalassemia minor. Serum folate is done for, obviously folate deficiency anemia. Homocysteine levels can be increased in B12 deficiency anemia. Isn't it? So, this is what is the idea. I have not read the question. I have ended up having a gross idea. Now, when I look at the question, I have to make a diagnosis. Either am I suspecting iron deficiency in this or am I suspecting thalassemia minor in this or I am suspecting folic acid deficiency or I am suspecting homocysteine EMA, basically B12 deficiency in this. This is how I will be approaching. So, I am going to make your questions very easy. You know, if you have this approach, you will end up uh, learn, uh, getting the questions very easily done. And also, you will end up having no stress at all for solving previous year question. Okay, let us see. A woman presented to OPD with fatigue, not required because all of them will have anemia. CBC shows hemoglobin 9. I can understand reduced MCV60. Now look at this straight away. My C and D are ruled out because both of them will be macrocytic anemia. MCV is decreased, so I am ruling out C and D in this. Now RBC count is 5.2 million. RBC count. Now look at this here. Very important. Hemoglobin is decreasing, isn't it? Hemoglobin is less. So this is your hemoglobin, by the way. Hemoglobin is less. So this is hemoglobin. 9 gram per deciliter, hemoglobin is reducing, but the RBC count is not reducing. What do you think of? Yes, this is what I am suspicious of, suspicious of thal minor now. In a IDA, this won't be happening. Why? Very, very important. In a IDA, I don't suspect like this because in IDA, RBC count should reduce. Your RBC count is disproportionately higher to the given hemoglobin. Okay, so when RBC count is disproportionately higher to the given hemoglobin, examiner is indirectly hinting you that he is talking about one thalassemia minor. So in this, I can straight away answer it as HbA2. One more on peripheral blood, we can do a Menzer index as well. So let me write what is Menzer index. If you remember, I discussed this also. Menzer index, tell me, Menzer index is ratio of MCV divided by RBC count. MCV is 60, RBC count is 5.2. So, I would say 5.2 into 10, 52. 52 plus 5.2 will be 57.2. So, 11. So, it is something, value will be approximately 11 point something. I don't know what is it. So, this is not a mathematical test. Don't worry about whatever point value comes. Who cares? It is less than 13. So, the moment uh, Menzer index is less than 13, so, if it is less than 13, I am definitely suspecting one thal minor in this. What do I do, sir? Yes, I will end up doing hemoglobin A2 level in this patient. Same question, they can ask you now, what will be, which HbA2 level will diagnose this condition? Answer will be 3.5 to 9 percent of HbA2. Now, if suppose this woman turns out to be thal minor, next what will be the question? What will you do next? If she turns out to be thal minor, we have to screen her husband as well. If he is thal minor, then if he is not thal minor, no problem. If he is also thal minor, then what? We have to check for what? Whenever they under, whenever there is a pregnancy, we have to do an antenatal or prenatal diagnosis. So by amniocentesis and check whether the fetus is homozygous or heterozygous. So, now look at this, one small topic, but you have ended up what? Learning three or four or five questions. Three questions on Thal minor we studied and how did I rule out? You ended up, for every question you will learn many more questions in PYQ, PYQ Kabab series. Do not miss pathology session. So, we will be seeing soon there.